leaving the hospital with your new hip can be very exciting and a little unnerving. In the hospital, you had access to nurses and other healthcare professionals around the clock. Now you're returning to your independence. You'll still have the support of your healthcare team as you resume daily activities after hip replacement surgery, and you'll enjoy the comforts of home. However, this may be an uncertain time for you. You will continue the exercises you began in the hospital and gradually increase the number and duration of the exercises. Patients who have had hip replacement tend to agree that the exercise program is crucial. If you used a continuous passive motion machine in the hospital, your healthcare team may ask you to continue with it at home. This device is used to gently flex and extend the hip joint. During recovery, you will progress from using your walker or crutches to a cane. If you have no problems, you'll graduate to walking on your own. Eventually, you will be allowed to climb stairs. In most cases, patients begin with smaller height steps and gradually progress to standard height steps. You will also be advised to gradually increase household activities, such as cooking, cleaning, and doing laundry. You will be allowed to take a shower without limitations when your incision heals. Between 6 and 12 weeks after surgery, new exercises may be added to your regimen, such as toe and heel raises, partial knee bends, hip abduction, leg balance, and riding a stationary bicycle. Your surgeon will tell you when you can return to activities like walking without a cane, walker, or crutches, driving a car, and returning to work. Of course, determining the date you return to work will depend on the type of work you do. An office worker places less stress on a hip than a construction worker. People who do manual labor or tasks requiring squatting or climbing steep stairs may have to discuss vocational counseling with their surgeon. Staying active during recovery will help control your weight and maintain muscle tone. There will be some limitations, but taking the time to recover is worth the inconvenience. You'll need to consult with your surgeon about returning to work, sports, and other recreational activities. It is not uncommon to still experience some pain because a full recovery typically takes three to six months. Hip replacement operations are generally successful in relieving pain and restoring movement. However, a repeat procedure and replacement of the prosthesis at some point is sometimes necessary because of wear and tear on the joint or the effects of particles produced by the implant parts moving against each other. Talk to your surgeon about his or her experience with the longevity of hip replacements. A fall during the first few weeks after surgery can damage your new hip and may result in a need for more surgery. Stairs are a particular hazard until your hip is strong and mobile. You should use a cane, crutches, a walker, or handrails, or have someone help you until you improve your balance, flexibility, and strength. Your orthopedic surgeon and physical therapist will help you decide the type and the length of time assistive aids will be required following surgery. To achieve proper recovery and prevent dislocation of the prosthesis, you must take special precautions. Do not cross your legs. Do not bend your hips more than a right angle, 90 degrees. Do not turn your feet excessively inward or outward. Use a pillow between your legs at night when sleeping until you are advised by your orthopedic surgeon that you can remove it. I've been very active my whole life and uh, I thought I was gonna have to give up skiing. I can ski now, I'm skiing with my grandchildren. I uh, play tennis with all my friends that uh, I had to give up for a while and now I'm back and we're on uh, a variety of teams. It's a great social activity. It's very fun. I think the, do, doing the recovery process or the rehabilitation process, the first probably three to four, five months, you know it's there. But as if you take the re rehabilitation process seriously and build the muscle and tissue up around it, it literally just becomes a part of your body and you almost don't know it's there. But it's just amazing the difference that I'm able to, you, we take so many, I hate to sound cliche, it's probably take so many things for, for granted, but just the ability to be able to walk uh, without 
a problem is quite gratifying. So I'm I'm very uh, I'm actually very thankful that I that I a had the process and b the process went so smoothly. The time element is I think critical for a lot of people, and like how do I fit it in? And the way I looked at it, the way we looked at it was. How much time are we giving up right now to pain? How much are we compensating for what we can and cannot do? You know, like we're giving up a lot of time and we got, you know, we're in our early 50s. Are you kidding me? You know, we, can't we carve out a little section of time which will give us a great quality of life, no pain, and me back my, my mobility? With the advanced joint replacement technology available today, patients with severe arthritis no longer have to live with pain, stiffness, and reduced mobility. You now have the information you need to talk with your doctor about whether joint replacement is the right option for you. My Depew hips have, first of all, given me the freedom to coach again, to keep on with a career that I would have had to literally give up in my early 50s. The Pew hips have given me mobility to work out again, you know, to feel like the athlete, maybe not the young athlete that I was a long time ago, but to, to actually maintain a more positive self-image. Uh, the Pew Hips have helped me be a better gardener and worker, you know, being outside and, uh, and being a better husband and father and grandfather. Where I, you know, nobody, my grandchildren don't, they don't know that I have artificial hips, you know, because Poppy's, Poppy looks like he can move pretty good, you know. Uh, so it, it, the Pew's given me a different life that the Pew Hips have made it possible for, me, for us to have a different life. Well, his the Pew Hips gave me back this kind of intense, uh, passionate winner that I had married and that I had known my whole life who was beginning to doubt if he was a winner because of his of his pain and his immobility. And his to few hips gave me back my winner. Like you, I've experienced the pain and loss of mobility because of osteoarthritis in my hips, and it nearly cost me the career I love. When osteoarthritis threatened to keep me off the courts eight years ago, my orthopedic surgeon recommended hip replacement from the Pew. Now, I'm at the top of my game. Since then, there are advancements in hip replacements from Depew Orthopedics, like Pinnacle Hip Solutions, that can help you get back to what you love. Depew Orthopedics continues to lead the way with advanced hip replacement products like Pinnacle Hip Solutions. Pinnacle Hip Solutions are uniquely designed to help meet the demands of today's active patients by reducing pain and restoring a more fluid range of natural motion. Only Pinnacle Hip Solutions with True Glide technology works with your body to create a natural film of lubrication between the implant surfaces for more natural movement. And Depew Orthopedics Pinnacle Hip Solutions are designed so your surgeon can choose which bearing surface will best meet your needs. This system provides advanced technology for recreating the natural ball and socket joint of the hip to help increase joint stability and range of motion. I am pretty active. I played university, I played football in university, and I've stayed pretty active since then. Uh, I used to run quite a bit, and now I'm a cyclist. I spend about three or four days a week in the gym, and a couple days of yoga. I have um, the Depew Pinnacle Hip, and I was hoping for something that would give me the most amount of flexibility possible, and this is the device that was recommended. I, I was advised to have the Depew uh, Pinnacle implant and I looked at it online and did some 
studying with it and uh, for my needs and uh, the range of movement that I require for to continue to be active, it seemed to have all the qualifications that I needed. Um, I'm, I'm confident in my physician's advice as well and uh, I was happy with that recommendation. But I think a lot of people do say that they should have done it sooner after they've done it and I'm definitely one of those people. I feel fabulous. I'm doing everything I've ever done plus more. Um, I, I couldn't feel better. The uh, debut pinnacle uh, hip that I have has allowed me to resume all activities that I had have done in the past. It's very, uh, my movements are very complete. I can go on the exercise equipment. I can do all my exercises on the weight equipment, uh, on my cardio exercise. I play sports, and it's it's. I don't even think about it. I don't even think about it anymore. To get a Depew hip was not just a good move, it was a great move, you know, because it, it, it made me a coach again, and I'm going to coach for a long time.